Well, you just never know who you're going to find here at the Santos Tour Down Under. It could be Eddie Merckx, it could be Lance Armstrong, it could be Mr South Australia, Keith Conlon. How are you going on the bike? I'm bugging, I'm still warming up. Have you started yet? That goes that way. I'm just trying to work out how these gears work. Might I haven't got flash gears on my bike. Remember in the old days you used to have the old um, playing card in the spokes flicking around? Yeah, exactly. I, I liked it when you just had the three gears on the front, you know, in the old days. Basket with a little flower on the front? <laughs> you saw my bike. Yeah, I did. We had spoky dokies back in Millicent. All right, what are you expecting? You're riding the... Uh, 5AA one kilometre challenge. What time are you looking for? Uh, I, I'm actually looking to finish. You know, as they say, it's more of a more of a booper challenge moment for me. Just finish. It's not. It is not so much the finish, but the journey for me. We spoke to Stuart O'Grady. He said yeah. uh, he's yeah, going for a finish. six hour ride just to warm up. How many? How long? Six hours. Oh, <laughs> I get a stitch in the car for six hours. Six minutes is too long for me, mate. Yeah, that's crazy. I I'm nearly there. I, I think right. the warm up. You, you don't want to. You don't want to. So you've got to save it for the road, don't you? The thing I like too is that everyone else wears the lycra, which is really unnecessary. You've dressed for the occasion well, today. You've got the Santos Tour down under boat shoes. Yeah, yeah. I'm actually uh, banned from wearing lycra by my good wife Susie, uh, except on special occasions, and this is not one of them. I'm allowed to ride down the Torrance Linear Park as long as there's nobody around. There's a mental image for everyone. Let's start, shall we? To get that mental image of Keith and Lycra out, here's Jess. <laughs> well, we're ready. Here we go. Good luck. All right, wait a minute. All right. The official time is ready to go. Hang on, I have checked. Get out of Jess's shot. Fancy around here. All right, we ready, Keith? Yeah, I'm ready. Ready, set, go. 16 tonight, mostly sunny on Friday, 33 and more of the same for Saturday. Then partly cloudy on Sunday up to 30. Doing 33 k's an hour. I've never gone this far. I'm at 28. More than you said. Do you know what would be hilarious if the wheel came out and you actually just went straight into that? <laughs> yeah, be terrific. Yeah, right. Thanks for that. Alright, serious now. What's he at? He's, uh, he's going relatively slow here. Very slow indeed, actually. He's at 35 seconds. How many has he done so far? Was it point three? You're struggling, big fella. He's battling big time. Just think he's only got five hours and fifty nine minutes to match Stuart O'Grady. <laughs> Pays an hour. Can I get a picture of you looking in pain? Real easy. <laughs> Just look up, look up. Ah, ah. Oh. <laughs> Very Have you seen Jess? Crikey. Point seven. The last bit's the hardest bit. Three quarters of the way. Point eight. One minute twenty. Point eight. You're looking good though. It'd beat two minutes and three seconds, Keith. In the words of Stephen Rowe, do something. Go. Fantastic time of one minute and 44 seconds. Happy with that? Hey. Happy with that? What do you say? <laughs> have I stopped? Whoa, whoa. That's a good time because if you have a look, you're the fastest so far. <laughs> Best on the day. 